Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to turn on or off internet printing on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So we are going to start off by opening up the search menu. Type in regedit, best match to come back with Regedit editor. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And before you proceed in the registry, I would highly suggest you create a backup of it. So if anything went wrong or you wanted to change your mind later, I'm going to show you guys how to create a backup. So just select file and then export. File name, name it the date that you're making the backup. Set export range to all. And then save it to an easily accessible location on your computer or external hard drive. And if you ever need to import it back in, all you would do is select file and then import and then navigate to the file location. And now we're ready to begin. So we're going to start off by double clicking on the HK local machine folder. Do the same thing now for the software folder. Same thing for policies. Should be a Microsoft folder in here. Double click on that. And now locate Windows NT. Just left click on that. And right click on the Windows NT folder. Select new. And then you want to select key. You want to name this key printers and hit enter. And now on the right side, you want to right click in a blank area, select new, and then select the word 32 bit value. Name this value disable web printing and hit enter. Now, if you want to disable web printing, double click on this D word value and set the value down at a one and select OK. If you wanted to re-enable web printing, you could just delete this whole printers folder by just right-clicking on it and then selecting delete. See this printers folder, just right-click and delete it, it would delete all of this. Or you could just set this disable web printing value to zero, which would be the default, which would not disable web printing. It would, in fact, enable or keep web printing in the on state. So pretty straightforward process on that, guys. And you would need to restart your computer in order for the change to take effect. So go ahead and restart your computer. And hopefully that was able to either turn on or off internet printing depending on your preference. So as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.